Hi everyone. I'm supposed to be gone by now. My headlights out in my car and I'm supposed to be at the repair shop in 30 minutes. So let's see if I can get out of here soon. Okay. I woke up with a raging headache. Where did these things come from? It's only happened the last couple day, a couple nights. Uh, I wake up with a headache when I go to bed and I take a Flexerol at, at night to help me relax because I've had insomnia, right? <laughs> had it really bad, but it start, it brought, what brought it on was the coughing. Uh, then my body got used to staying up all night, you know? So now I'm, I'm going to sleep on time. I'm getting rest, but then I, I, take a flexorol at night, a muscle relaxer, and I wake up with this headache, so I'm not going to take one tonight. Let's see if that eradicates it, right? So I didn't accomplish much the last couple days because it's been raining. So I did get my dishes caught up. That's a big feat <laughs> in some people's lives. I know my little sister has to do dishes for her entire family, and it's a big feat, especially when you have degenerative disc disease, right? It's a big feat. So I'm gonna dye my hair tonight, and my, oh. every time I look in the mirror, I just get uglier, I don't know. Yeah, doing dishes is a big deal. Uh, I need coffee. Oh, my God. So I did get a couple things accomplished. I have an attic in my bedroom. The pool string when I bought this house was filthy from, I guess, all the work people touching it, you know. So I replaced the string and I cleaned up all their fingerprints on the outside of the attic. It was just bothering me. These kind of things bother me. I don't know. And I brought down this origami rack, which I'm going to use inside my storage. Um, my my, my out, outdoor shed when I get that... Um, Put up, and who knows when that is, right? Who knows? I, uh, uh, I ha my my grass now is the worst grass in the neighborhood. I was trying to do a good job. Well, you know, it took me a while to get the lawnmower. Ah, uh, let's see. It took me a while to, to figure out the gas can. I had to get oil in it. All these little things that some men take for granted, but us women who've never done it before, you know, it's a learning curve there. See, that's not the right kind of purple. Ah, so let's see what, so let's see what we got here. My next feat is to organize my makeup desk yeah my makeup table whatever so bear with me i'm probably rambling so the garden is pretty much in we had to stake everything and cage everything because i don't know which animals are doing it but they're sitting they're sitting on on the plants oh god Yeah, every day that I wake up, I, I feel uh, one year older, or I feel older. <laughs> so I'm going, my granddaughter's taking me to Olive Garden tonight. And I have a couple gifts for my grandson I'm going to drop off in the Berg. So let's see, what else? 
Oh, I can't think. I can't think, people. I love these little uh, combs I showed to you when you get out of the shower. These are nice. That's if you have hair. I know a lot of guys watching me don't have hair, but that's okay. But look at this now. I got two different colors. Okay. Ah. Uh, you know, my granddaughter was following me down the road. She said, Nanny, one of your headlights was out. It's the little one. It's the little one on top of the big one. Does that make any sense? Uh, yeah. And, uh, oh, my head is just pounding. I wish I could cancel. But I know my headache will go away in just a little bit. This is the right kind of blue. I got this in Vegas. This is the right kind of blue. So let's get into this one. Uh, first time my husband and I went to Vegas, we loved it. We loved it. We loved it so much. We had tickets to Hawaii. We canceled those. Stayed in Vegas. We should have gone on to Hawaii. <laughs> right? I had a couple opportunities to go to Hawaii, and I needed to work in my office and I needed, I don't like to do anything, go anywhere unless I'm caught up with other things, right? Uh, isn't this a pretty blue? So the lollipop kids help, helps me when it's like not raining so much. I keep telling them, you know, they're not going to melt in the rain. I don't think they believe me. They have to get right up on me so I can talk to them. Because, of course, I'm going deaf. Oh. So, um, let's see. Let's get some eyeliner on. I'm sorry about my headache. Sorry. Nope. Didn't make up my bed today, people. Oh my god. Now I'm stuck in now I'm stuck in my chair. Ah So let's see. Let's see if we can get something underneath in my eyes. Uh-huh. Forget that. I better hurry. So, oh God, I don't even know what I don't even know what to talk about. What should we talk about? Still haven't watched TV in the last three months. There's, I don't think there's anything decent on. Do, do you all agree? I just don't think there's anything decent on TV. I do watch reruns of Everybody Loves Raymond. I like that. Yeah. Parallels with my life pretty much because my ex worked very hard, but he didn't do too much around the house. So maybe work on a boat motor. So, pretty much had to raise the children and do all of the housework and everything. And hold down a full-time job at the Sheriff's Department. You know, boy, times have changed, hasn't it? So, next week I have to go find a job. I was thinking about working for the city. You know, because they get all the holidays off. I don't think I'll be going to the Caribbean as much anymore. Uh, you know, I've seen what there is to see. 
right? I've seen there all, all is to see. Uh, I was going to go to the Colonial Beach Bike Week. I canceled my hotel there. Um, that's, that's a pretty long drive for me now. I do miss it though, but the whole neighborhood has changed since I left. Everything's gotten very sophisticated. I think that the residents of Colonial Beach are going to regret a lot of decisions the government there has made. Oh, I particularly like Willie's on the boardwalk. Renee. Renee is the reason why I moved to Colonial Beach. They have the best barbecue. Oh, my God. I mean, barbecue without all the fat in it, you know. I really need to sit here one night and just work on a stupid makeup table. Ugh. And I have some, I've been having some wild dreams lately. Dreamed I was on the back of a motorcycle. Uh-huh. Which I would never do. It's too damn dangerous. So, oh, shoot. I got to get out of here. Mm. Let me gulp down the coffee. Everybody's buying from Timu. I haven't seen any reviews. I know uh, the stuff uh, very cheap, but I think you have to wait a couple weeks for it. You know what I mean? Uh, so I'm going to enjoy going to the Olive Garden. Right. I only go there maybe once a year. Uh, can't put in my grass seed until I mow my grass, right? What, I mean, my weeds. Can't put in the grass seed until I mow my weeds. So I'm very proud of myself because last week I had to run a U-Haul and uh, get the... Um, Door, the, the outdoor shed uh, delivered. I think we had five people lifting it. It was, it was no problem at all. Many hands. Many hands help people. They try so hard, the lollipop kids, to help me. And I am very, very grateful. I give them bubble gum. Parents are probably going to hate me when they take them to the dentist, though. Oh, my God. Uh, yeah, I give them some bubble gum and some... Um, oh, what are those things you suck on? Uh, Jolly Ranchers. That's it. I love Jolly Ranchers. They have a lot of flavor. Well, thanks for helping me. Get ready. Yep. Got to dye my hair tonight. Oh, my God. <laughs> All right. Bye.